one person's aspect of a quality of life is becoming an active member in their community. This also means getting involved on boards, councils, or committees that matter to them. Hi, my name is Ryan Bartz from the USD Center for Disabilities, and today we will spotlight three individuals from diverse regions of South Dakota and how they are making a difference in their local communities. Well, my name is Cindy Roneagle. I live in Rapid City, South Dakota. Hi, I'm Ron I'm from Sioux I'm originally from um, Baltic, South Dakota, but I live in Vermillion, South Dakota. Question one. What boards, councils, and committees do you serve on? I was involved with the Council for Developmental Disabilities, the South Dakota Council, uh, for 12 years. Um, and I currently now am on our People First, which will be turning into the A-Team this uh, end of this month. Currently, I am a vice chairman of the Sioux of the Ranch Advisory Council, and I'm also currently a secretary editor of the ILCR in the, in the Living Voices Board of Rutgers, and I also serve on the Center for Disability Advisory Board. I have also been a chairman of the Board of Be well, Rehab for the sake of Safa I'm on the Board of Director Foundation Board for SESDAC in Vermillion. Question 2. Where did you hear about a board, council, or a committee that you were interested in? I got um, involved with uh, speaking through the ARC, and from there it just went from, it just snowballed, literally. It just, and then years later I got on the council, got off, went back on, and I got off. So it's been a total of 12 years, so um, with the, the People First thing, we, they started that as a, started out as a grassroots kind of thing, and then now it's turned into this A-team thing, because that's what everybody's leaning towards now. I actually um, went to a youth leadership forum back when I was younger, and I learned about like helping people like that have disabilities and I also have a disability so I wanted to help others and try to direct what's good for people and what's not. So it helps me to have a way to help in on the services that I use and with ILC I have received services from ILC almost since I was 18 years old and serving on the board of records helps me give back to the organization that have helped me. So it's about my way of giving back. Question three. Why is it important to participate on a board, council, or a committee? Uh, to share your ideas and your beliefs and to give voice to those who may never have that chance and also to give yourself some confidence in doing it. Serving on the board or a meeting or a council is one of the best ways to at your point of view across to other people. People who are involved more may have a lot of knowledge of their own area, whether it's business or finances or their own wants and needs. But you are a best one to share what your needs are or you share what 
uttered me not with my instability. People can learn from like other people. Like, let's say we can, like, I come up with something and they're like, no, we could do it a different way. Well, if that person is new, then we would realize what they could do to help us, so. The fourth and final question. What advice would you tell a person with a disability who would want to put themselves out there on a board, council, or a committee? I would strongly encourage them to do so. Um, they may not have, they may think that they don't have what it takes, but it's really in all of us that we, that we do do this work and that we all share our values and opinions and to show that um, that it can, it's possible to change the direction of what they think is the right right path, and in reality, it's not the right path. There are so many of what are out, so being a leader of your own community, if you are not aware of any, ask your friends or ask somebody that you get your service into. Many of our groups have a library council. When you are on the board, you may not always get everything that you want or need, but you can help decide a better situation for all. If you want something in life, and you're not like getting represented um, by your agency, there are people that you can go to that will advise you like to help you like get support for it. There you have it. People with disabilities making a difference in their own communities. What we just showed you in this video were one of many ways to get involved and to bring something to the table. So, in your community, what do you want to do? For more information about the Center for Disabilities, please call 1-800-658-3080 or 605-357-1439. You can also email us at cd at usd.edu or follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Thanks for watching. See you soon.